Hey, what is up, Phone Dogs? Bo HD here, and go figure that right after I upload my full review of the Dell Venue 8 7000, Intel releases an update to enable measurements using the Intel RealSense 3D cameras. So in this video, I'm going to demo everything you can do with the depth data and also test to see just how accurate it is here on Phone Dog. So this is the Dell Venue 8 7000, and on the back of this tablet features three cameras. There's two 720p capable cameras to capture strictly depth-related information, and then one 8 megapixel camera sensor at the bottom. Now I mentioned in my full review that the camera quality is pretty bad, and unfortunately, it still is after the update. But that doesn't mean you can't do some cool things with the Intel RealSense technology. For example, if we boot up the camera app, we'll see that first of all it launches in landscape mode, and in the upper left hand corner there's two different camera angles that record depth in the images you capture. So if we go back to one of the images I already captured, we'll see that we have a couple different options in regards to what we can do with the depth information. The first is a measurement tool, so you can tap on the ruler icon and measure various subjects in our photos, and it'll give us a rough measurement. All you have to do is tap on one part of the subject and then tap on another part of the subject and it will give you an approximate line measurement. And there's even a little magnifying glass to help you pinpoint exactly where you want to measure. What's also neat is that it can calculate surface area in square feet in a similar process. You just need to drag a few more lines around the subject and it should give you a rough estimate if there's enough data recorded. Another neat feature you can do with the Intel RealSense technology is refocus your subjects after a photo has been captured. You can tap on the focus icon next to the measurement tool and it'll present you with a slider where you can adjust the depth of field. For example, you just need to tap on the subject you want to view in focus and then move the slider all the way to the right and your picture will look very bokehlicious. Yeah, that's right. I just said that. So yeah, that is really the two main depth related features you can do with the Intel RealSense 3D cameras. I did capture several images though, where I measured these subjects in real life and then measured them with the Intel RealSense cameras to see just how accurate the technology is. I do want to note that I did recently install the update and Intel did warn me that it will become more accurate the more I use this feature. But with that said, the first image is one of my white IKEA desks. It measures in at about 3.2 feet or 39 and 3 eighths inches. The Intel RealSense measurement tool says it's about 3.4 feet in length, so it's actually very, very close. The next item I captured is of a drawer unit that measures in at 27.5 inches or about 2.29 feet. The Intel RealSense measurement tool says it's about 2.3 feet so it was just about spot on. You really can't get much more accurate than that. So did a good job. Now for the third test, I wanted to try to measure some of the items on my desk via a almost face down view. I measured my Nexus 9, which has the HTC Magic cover on it, and the Intel RealSense tech estimated it to be about eight inches in length. The actual length is about nine inches. So once again, it was very close. So anyway, I hope this video helped you guys get a better idea as to what exactly the Intel RealSense 3D camera technology is capable of. It actually was a lot more accurate than I thought it would be. I thought it would have more trouble with the last image, but it did a pretty good job. You just need to make sure you pinpoint each point as accurately as possible. So let me know what you think of the Intel RealSense technology by leaving a comment down below. Would you use it or is it a gimmick? Let me know what your thoughts are by leaving a comment down below, and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. It definitely helps show your support. But as always, I'm BoHD from PhoneDog.com. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. See ya.